Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, SciTech. In this one, I'm going to do the Android benchmark test in the IQ7 device using the SpinBot cooling fan. So right now, I do have the SpinBot uh, cooling fan as you can clearly see, friends. So previously, I did upload uh, plenty of videos using the Realme cooling clip, and a lot of users that did ask me to choose this SpinBot cooling clip in this video. So that's what this video is about. And this video, I'm trying to use the Monster mode after its Android 12 update, uh, which the IQ7 did receive. Let's see friends how much high score we can actually expect in this IQ sound device after this Android 12 update using this kind of monster mode as well. So here's a battery option, I'll try to select the monster mode and all the apps are completely clear from the background RAM management. And here's a Android benchmark application test which I'll try to open. And let me to disable this ultra game mode so which I don't require. So let me to close and open again. Yes. So right now there is no ultra game mode, just only monster mode has been enabled and the battery is of 98% so it should be completely kind of good to go. And this is a score which we got in the Ico sound device. So let me take that screenshot if possible. Right now I did take the screenshot as well. Now let me to start the test at this moment using this kind of uh, cooling clip. Let's go back. And after the Android 12 update, the IQ7 was able to reach very good high scores. Yes, friends, especially up to 7 lakhs, 20 and 30,000 as well. Let's see using this kind of uh, cooling clip from the spin board, whether the phone can actually reach high temperatures or not. Right now, it's kind of pretty low. It's only 26 degrees Celsius at this moment, 27. Again, I'll be back after some time just to check the temperatures, what's going on in the IQ7 device. So right now as you can see friends, we did reach the Android benchmark percentage is about 80 percentage and the temperatures did increase up to 31 degrees Celsius on the bottom of the screen is about 27, 28, 30, 31.4 on the back set 30.4 degrees Celsius it did increase and you can see the bottom as well 28.4 and overall you can look inside friends inside it's very high temperatures because I am getting uh, really very high I mean warm hair air on the back side as you can see so definitely it's really very warm so inside it's 37 degrees celsius inside this cooling fan and side of this one it's about 27.8 exactly on the side and on the top 30.6 degrees celsius let's see how much high score we can actually expect in this iQ sound device using this spin boat cooling system and this is my first time doing this kind of cooling system previously i did do use this realme cooling clip but not this spin board i can be back after some time so right now as you can see friends, uh, we are kind of close to end of the benchmark test results right. So let's check the final temperatures 30.6 degrees Celsius. And this complete test is done only using spin board. So let's see friends how much high scores we can actually expect in this uh, IQ sound device in this kind of spin board cooling system. In case if you want me to do this kind of test on other smartphones, let me know in the comments on which smartphones you want me to use this spin board cooling fan. I can definitely do that video as soon as possible. And finally, we got the score about uh, six, I mean, seven lakhs, 21,000. Wow, that's pretty high score. As you can clearly see, friends, using the monster mode, not bad. As you can see, so I'll try to take the screenshot. Let me need to remove and check this exact temperatures, how much it is. And I can see the water droplets as well. You can see the water droplets, I'm not sure. As you can clearly see, friends, not bad. That's pretty cool. Damn. Yes, I can see the water droplets as well. Here and there in the, on the phone as well. That's pretty good friends regarding the temperature wise. So overall we got the score about uh, 7 lakhs 21,000 regarding the Android benchmark test in the IQ sound device. It's kind of above 7 lakhs 20,000 anyway. So CPU and the GPU were perfectly alright with the overall uh, scores result in this device. Battery drain by 3% and temperature is about 27.7 and 38 degrees Celsius. That's it friends. Thank you for watching this a quick uh, Android benchmark test on this IQ sound device. And let me show you the screenshot before and after before and after you can see the slightly increased cpu and the gpu scores before and after with and without cooling clip and you can see the temperature how much it increased 6.8 degrees but now 2.8 degrees so that's friends thank you for watching and see you in the next video until instead of more updates signing off and bye